Good morning, Skakes here. Um, I'm going to take a quick break from showing off uh, some of the things I've been creating world-wise. Uh, and show you something I've discovered and or invented. Uh, I may not be the only one to have discovered this, but I haven't seen anything like it. So, to start with, I just... I found this online. It's how to make probably the the one of the fastest redstone pulses. And it and a repeater. I have to get a torch. Um what is this? By the way, if you've never played with single player commands, it's awesome if you're doing any major building projects. Or, uh, as I am, huh, uh, as, as I am uh, doing, creating a, an adventure map. Um, I started it, uh, as they say, legit. I always think I spawned on a dangerous uh, I created a lot of the map uh, legit, as they say, but after a while my vision got bigger than my abilities. Um, I downloaded and installed single player commands. Okay, so. Four redstone torches around the edges. Bit of redstone powder in the middle. Don't know why this works. It was never explained why it works, and I don't know that there's a good reason why it works. And a block over each torch. I'm very, very new to redstone. Uh, these can be like suspended in midair blocks or whatever. Alright, so now is you've got a very rapidly fluctuating signal, and you can pull redstone from either of the four directions, attach whatever you like to it. It'll go on like that pretty much forever, and it's annoying, and if you have multiple things, it can get really, really loud. Yeah, it's called an annoyance engine. You have a couple different styles. And the idea is you bury it under someone's house. That's this irritating noise they've got to deal with. Now I'm making a horror-based map, and so strange noises are not a bad thing. And that's what I was creating. Um, it is a bit much. So I thought to myself, self, you know crap about redstone and how it works. And, uh... So maybe we can do a little experimenting, and uh, you know, because I know nothing, we did that backwards. I think they can't figure out some way to uh, trigger it, right? So it'll go nuts, but only say yes to you. out, and I ran some redstone out to a switch to see if that would work. What I discovered is that whatever the magical power that makes this thing work, it's still, still going, right? It does not need all four torches. However, there is a difference now. intermittent and unpredictable. So just when you think it's done, it'll kick up again. Of course, it probably won't because we're watching. Uh, but it, it's... <laughs> it just runs for a while and then stops and runs for a while and stops. Um, I, I've got one that seems to pulse regularly, like every few seconds.
that to add some uh, uh, interesting background sounds. So, in case someone else wanted to try it out, please uh, stay tuned to my channel for more about the Crimson Asylum Horror map I'm making. Uh, just put a teaser up for it today. is out.